Okay, so, so much of what uh, inspires me uh, to write uh, about tradecraft and, and uh, some unique skill sets uh, for the blog is, in fact, fiction. Um, is um, reading about something that, that seems like a lot of fun and, and interesting and being able to think about how do you apply um, the skills in fiction and the nonfiction skills to reality and to, uh, to be a, a um, live a safer, better environment, whatever. Um, so in my last post, we talked about urban movement and how to move through the city, how to produce um, urban um, surveillance uh, so that you're able to get from point A to, to point B. Uh, without kind of Big Brother being able to oversee you. And so what I was thinking was it would be kind of cool to take that concept of the, the technology uh, that is available to us um, and then apply it to a fictional motif that we often see in movies and television. Um, and that's the, um, the, the kind of uh, uh, tactical support that an individual can get, an operative can get from that's working in the field from someone at home, at, at their home base. Um, so I think of like Jack Bauer series 24, uh, Jack being able to call Chloe for as assistance or um, the movie uh, Mile 22, where they had this uh, kind of fictitious Overwatch program where they kind of provide some, you know, some of that tactical support for that unit on the ground. Surely there is some kind of element of reality to that, you know, the, a, a case officer might be able to call in um, to get some language support, for example, or um, I'm sure there's other other better examples out there to share. But uh, so what I was thinking was you could take your um, the skills uh, that you you kind of take from this urban reconnaissance, this urban movement, and then apply it to a team out in the field. Um, say you're trying to protect a community or you are, um, you know, doing whatever it is that you're doing where you have people out in the field, you could use your APRS capability that we talked about in the previous post and show kind of real time, um, you know, um, information about where, where your teammates are in the field. You can use the radios to monitor, um, you know, bad actors, monitor, um, you know, police and fire. Uh, you can use the radios to monitor news um, as well as social media, um, seeing kind of what's going on real time. So it's about kind of taking all these tools that are available and putting it together into a package um, that could provide that necessary oversight, that command and control capability um, that we see in the movies uh, in real life. So hopefully this was just kind of a, a little bit of a, a thought experiment, more or less, or a, um, a, an idea. Um, and, you know, my go kit here is kind of a, just a representation of maybe what that could be uh, or could start to, start to look like. Um, if you like this idea or want to expand on this idea or have some ideas to share, please do so in the comments. Let me know. Uh, I'd love to hear from you. But otherwise... Um, Check out the blog post if you're interested in urban movement and kind of staying under the radar. Uh, I think we did a pretty good um, description of how to do that. Um, all right, until the next one.